Hello, Benny, and I can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm sorry for not posting this video yet. <laughs> There's lag on Zach's I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. You know, I'm just making it up to you with a farewell. Oh, I'm kidding. A double video today, and everybody will love it. So, what I'm talking about is the problem with some G fans. I know I'm not talking about Godzilla, but this isn't Godzilla. I mean, this isn't Godzilla. This is Zilla. Or now I like to call him Super Zilla. He's better than the G Godzilla. I don't really know. I talk to him in my Zilla Does Not Stink video, but here's the more Madison's. Like guys and Goomba does to talk about the video games he, he reviews. Yeah, I was watching Gag and Goomba before I did the video. Okay, so so Zilla is supposed to be I believe he's supposed to be the comeback to Ray Haley House and the Beast on Twenty Thousand Fathoms. And that's my perspective. He's the comeback. I know, I know, I know. We, we, we don't know what he is. But, I, I had another theory. Remember, remember Ray Harryhausen's movie, We 20 Million Miles to Earth? I think that creature could also be part of Zua. I mean, Zua isn't that tall, so he can't be as Godzilla. But, at the time, people thought it was Godzilla. And here's another film. You know King Kong? Yeah, that guy. He, he is not just an ape. I mean, like, Zilla is not just a giant lizard. Zilla has a perspective in the little bit of the Godzilla characters. There was an, a GMK, yeah. Yeah. Godzilla monster. Godzilla monster. Pack. <laughs> he asked, there was a reference to the, saying that the Americans saw Godzilla, but they didn't. But they didn't. And also in Godzilla Final Wars, when the monsters were attacked, remember when the monsters were attacking the world? Well, he wasn't just at the, um, at the, uh, in a key. He was actually in Free Seeds. The two scenes before the first scene were him destroying a city. The second scene was him destroying the city again. And then he he gets sucked up by the alien ship. The first scene is when he first got off. But people just think he's in one scene, but there's actually two, three, two, three scenes he is in. Now, I know, I know, I know this is starting to be long, but I have more to talk about. Zilla, he's a dinosaur. He's not like the beast from 25 Battles. I forget that. So, oh, he's a dinosaur, but not any mutated dinosaur. He is an, no, the, the Japan military set him out to destroy the Americans. I know that sounds crazy, but it acts, I think that's the backstory. Story. The Americans correct the Japanese created him so he can destroy the Americans and then they can take over New York. It's crazy, but I think it's true. I mean now one thing I have to say is it's really, really funny. It's really funny, but he might be Godzilla. Was clone. They must. I think the Amer I think the British cloned him. I don't really know how can the British get a hand of Godzilla. I think they got one of his like um little little scales there. And then when they put, and then they cloned it to make Zilla. Now Zilla is clever. Godzilla is not. When Goji Fan 98 was talking, he he did stuff that Godzilla never did. 
I mean, it was it was awesome. I mean, the movie was good. But now that you heard my analysis on Zilla, you probably will think twice about Zilla. Yeah, it, it's pretty hard to think about my analysis. But if other people think about it, they could get something all new. I mean, think about it. If you leave your theories, leave your theories down below. Oh, but hey, it's just a theory. I'm monster theory. And I'm not trying to replicate game theory because I told you like that show and I'm not trying to rip it off.